Well, good afternoon, friends. My name is Jason Makey. I'm one of the pastors of People's Church, and it is good to chat with you today. As Pastor Kate mentioned last week, uh, she and I are going to be taking turns leading a midweek devotion um, that we will publish both on Facebook and YouTube, and I'm so glad that you have decided to um, give this devotional time a try today and you know, it's very interesting. I um, had the experience this past week of of being completely almost overwhelmed by the news of COVID, of the elections, of the the racial strife that is happening in our country and, and the oppression that's going on. And it kind of felt like the whole world was on my shoulders and, and I felt kind of beaten down by that. And I was really struggling um, that day to to get out of kind of the funk that I was in. I don't know if that that's ever happened to you. And and that, that can be particularly difficult these days because um, if you pay attention to the news, most days it's never good, but it seems to be getting worse and worse and worse if you if you just focus on the headlines. So one of the practices that I do is, is mindfulness. And there's a Christian mindfulness that you can do that will help with um, these types of things, help you um, instead of having anxiety about the uh, future or the past, it really centers you in the present moment. And that's the point of mindfulness, is to be um, present in your current space in your body in your mind with what's going on now and any thoughts that pass your way um, anything that happens instead of judging your thoughts or what's going on you just become curious about them a and you can turn your attention in mindfulness many places and God's presence is one of them so um, Christian mindfulness um, online is a little bit more difficult uh, to do because it, it's not very engaging in terms of, of online video type stuff. But I figured we could try Christian mindfulness right now. And, um, and if you want to continue this type of thing, if this, this speaks to your spirit and you feel God's presence, I'd encourage you to do it on your own. Um, as well, set aside five to 25 minutes for mindfulness and set a timer and go for that. Um, so for this practice, um, if you could just take a moment and find a comfortable upright seat, um, someplace where you're not gonna fall asleep because that can happen sometimes too, um, but find, find a place where you can be comfortable and where it's quiet. And if you need to pause the video um, to be able to do that, please do then I'd like to invite you to close your eyes. Bring your attention intentionally into the present moment. Begin by noticing your breathing. Pay attention to the physical sensations of each breath, as well as the sensations throughout your body. Notice the contact your body has with the different surfaces that your body's touching, be it a chair or a couch or clothing. Notice sounds that are passing through your awareness. Allow your attention to dwell with these present moment experiences for a few moments. and then let them, let them pass. If it's helpful, take a couple of deep breaths, in and out, and feel the breath fill your lungs, and then escape through your mouth. Then allow your breathing to return back to its normal rhythm. As you breathe, acknowledge that each breath is being given by God. There's no need to think about it or analyze it. 
You're simply noticing that each breath is being given to you as something you receive rather than manufacture. As you breathe, practice receiving each breath in the moment as it's provided by God. Spend a few moments practicing this breath from God awareness. Now gently broaden your awareness to the space where you sit. Acknowledge that God is present in the room. Again, there's no need to think about this or feel a certain way about it. Just notice thoughts and feelings that arise as you attend to God's presence. Be curious about them, then let them go. As often as you notice your attention has wandered, bring back your attention to God's presence in the room. Cultivate an attitude of being rather than doing as you rest in God's presence. I'd encourage you now to pause the stream, the video, and continue to um, dwell and rest in God's presence for as long as you'd like. When your time is up, smile and thank God for being present with you during your time of quiet meditation. I'd encourage you to continue such practices um, regularly, um, not only to know where, notice God's presence with you, but to strengthen you and fortify you with God's love and grace for each day. Would you pray with me? Wonderful and gracious God, we thank you for all the opportunities that we have to notice your presence with us. We thank you for the moments that we're able to take to be mindful of all of the gifts from breath to everything happening, uh, to, to clothing, to everything that we have that is a gift from you. And we thank you for your love and grace that sustain us and care for us each and every day, that are present with us when we notice them and when we don't. And we thank you that we can never escape your love and grace, that we can never uh, fall beyond your reach. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. Well, I hope everybody has a great weekend, and I look forward to chatting with you in worship on Sunday.